Hello everyone, hope you are doing fine. Today in this tutorial we are going to cover how to use the UI slider in order to volume up and volume down a music or sound or let's say you have a background music in your game and sometimes you wanna uh, like uh, reduce the sound uh, like increase or decrease the sound so uh, this is, might be useful. So first of all let's go to uh, Unity asset store and use the sun pack free pack and uh, open it in your unity then download it it might take like several seconds okay import okay done uh, okay uh, the next thing we need to do is to like uh, create a script because you're going to use c sharp uh, in order to volume up and volume down and we will name it change music volume and uh, now go to your game view and create UI slider and the slider is here so let's go here and change it to be in the maximum value and the maximum value is 1 and the minimum value is 0 and it is floating not integer because if you keep it here you can see the floating number here so the value it returns is floating so okay Let's double click on the script to open. Okay, so uh, first of all, we need the slider and we need the like audio source in order to be able to change the like volume. So, first of all, before we create the variable for slider we need to uh, add the namespace unity engine dot ui user interface so this will allow us to create a public slider um, volume let's name it volume and the second one is the audio source so public audio source my uh, music okay so let's save the script and go back to unity and uh, in order to be able to see the uh, and manipulate these public variables we need to uh, attach it to a game object so we will attach it to our empty game object and we will name it music manager and then drag and drop it here okay now the first one asks for the like um, volume controller uh, which is the uh, like slider so we will drag this slider here and um, the next thing is the audio source so we cannot just drag this and drop it here we need to have an audio source and before we add the audio source if you go to like let me remove this we don't need it here uh, make sure that you have the audio listener attached to the main camera okay now come back here and add, add um, audio source and uh, take one of these let's say i will take the buy and attach it here and uh, now we have to add this audio source here attach the audio source to your music my music here and let's go back to unity and here in our update because we want to update the volume every time we uh, change this slide uh, slider uh, so if we uh, we want the slider volume like the number the value to be the same as uh, the volume for our music so if you come here and 
check it here you can see that the volume also start with from 0 to 1 it's the same as um, the slider uh, value and it takes uh, floating numbers too so uh, let's go back to script and say that um, uh, every time we update uh, we want my music that val volume to be volume that value so it takes the slider uh, value and uh, make the volume to be the same so save your script and go back to unity uh, I think I guess I did everything so uh, let's save our uh, like scene and play the game now uh, okay let's stop the game and we forgot to make it to loop so we want it to loop so we will see the effect uh, press this uh, tick here and play the okay now if you volume it down you can see that it uh, stopped I mean you cannot hear it it's not a stop uh, but uh, you cannot hear it and you can volume it up again okay okay hope you understand how to use sliders thanks for watching bye